I mean, he's just the most, I mean, he's very experienced. Um, he's been here for a really long time. Um, yeah, I hear Alex saying his leadership behind me, and I mean, that, that holds true. He was a leader even when, um, you know, Finn was starting. He was still our leader, and he was still um, encouraging everybody, encouraging Finn. Um, and so, yeah, it's just uh, when, he's, when he's in the huddle, it's, you know, there's just a veteran presence about him, and he knows and understands defenses really, really well. And um, with sorry, with the Jets defensively, they bring a pretty intense defense, right. um, and they've been on a hot streak these last three games. So, mm -hmm. um, what have you seen on field personally that you key in on? Yeah, I mean, I mean, obviously, you you look at, around the ball; they're running, they're running to it. Uh, they they play, um, you know, a, a version of Tampa two a lot, um, and there's just different types of. Uh, ways that they get to it and they disguise it really well and sometimes they'll have the nickel up sometimes they'll um, have the mic run back sometimes they'll have a safety um, kind of disguise and, and run to the middle of the field so uh, they do it in a multitude of ways and, and you know it kind of um, condenses the box a little bit when they do s certain things and, and the way they disguise it and the way they line up so um, yeah it's they're like you said they're a very intense group they uh, they're very active around the box and, and at the ball and um, you know we're, we have some things uh, you know schematically that um, you know on paper look good and you know we'll, we'll have to have a good week of practice and make sure that um, you know we execute on Sunday and last question for you nothing against Ryan Finley but do you think that Andy Dalton gives you the best chance to win on Sunday? I mean I think that's just what the coaches think I think that's kind of been the mindset you know we're trying to get our a win we're trying to get a win right now and and build on that and so um, you know the coaches think that that's you know the direction we need to go and um, we support their decision um, I mean, just a feeling that we're trying to do whatever we can to get a win. You know, uh, that's that's kind of been the, re the reaction for all of the things that have kind of happened um, with who's been playing and who's not been playing or, um, you know, who's been put in certain situations, et cetera, et cetera. You know, our, we think that um, we are doing and we're scheming and putting people in positions to be able to win a game. So. I mean, we're just looking for that and, you know, him making that decision and the coach making that decision uh, kind of just emphasizes that. Does that go? I, I'm, I'm, I mean, I guess that plays well in the locker room. I mean, I guess that plays well in the locker room. It's yeah, I mean, uh, we're just, I mean, I mean, as much as, I mean, I, I don't know if it's, it's everybody. Everybody just wants to win. And so, yeah, I mean, obviously um, making a decision, making a change, making, you know, doing whatever it takes to, to get that win is something that resonates, you know, heavily on our minds.